I'm gonna build a piston engine, and there's nothing you can do about it. Hello there, it's Dynamission, and welcome back to Scrap Mechanic. Today I'm gonna be building a piston engine, with blueprint editing. Well, let's go on with it. Now what you're gonna want to do is place down your lift, and then build a little pass-through, like this. Then build a little pillar, connect it, and now you have something useful. Just gonna weld it to the ground for now. And then now you're gonna want to build a second one. So like this. And now you need bearings. Like this. You're gonna place one of those for the engine. Place another piston. And then now I'm just gonna Maybe make a. No. I'm not gonna make one of these. Okay, now what you're gonna want to do is build up like this. T piece. And then now you're just going to want to build out from like this with a block. going to want to make this z-axis zero or height whatever it is now you can grab your other pass through Grab it like this. I connected it in the wrong area. There you go. Now these are one object. Now you're gonna want to grab your bearings, connect your T pieces and then grab a pipe piece and then weld it to uh, weld it to your other thing this is to uh, reinforce the frame. Now you're going to want to grab pistons like this. Grab your blueprint editing tool. Raise it up by mm, the Z axis. Now you're going to want to grab these elbow pieces and connect it all the way there, like that. Now you want to grab your controller. You can place it wherever you, wherever you want to, it doesn't really matter. Connect the bearings. Like that. And now you're going to want to make them go 45 degrees, like that. I'm going to build a little pillar so I can Work on it easier. There you go. Place your bearings on it. And then you're going to want to 
grab your elbow pieces again. Like that. You want them to be in this kind of formation. But not exactly like that, but similar to it. Disconnect these bearings. You don't need them anymore. And then you're going to want to add your, uh, what do you call it? Whatever you call this, the axle. Or the shaft, can't, can't remember. But it's a put, mm, you need to make one of these. And now you're going to weld them together like this. I'm going to remove this controller for now and then add it to and then I'm going to add it to this uh, thing over here and you're going to need two controllers for this and you're going to want to lower the z-axis Hold on. There you go. I have it again. Now, what you're going to want to do now is build a slab so it doesn't fly away if it lets me okay there you go Okay, I'm just going to put a temporary controller down. Okay, now I'm just going to default to 90 degrees. So it doesn't break anymore. Okay, now you can put it on the lift. I... Oh. Um. There you go. Um. I can just keep it up, mm, up there for now. We move this controller and then now you can build it your engine uh, axle like this now I'm gonna build a sensor wheel there you go now I'm gonna make the sensor wheel I already forgot something hold on But now you're gonna gonna get your paint tool, paint these, or paint these blocks. Turn these color mode on and sensors on. There you go. Connect this controller. I mean, this bearing with the controller over there. Not this one. This one. And then you're gonna want to build a pillar. Go. 
default these to 90 degrees. you're going to want to con connect these sensors to these pistons. There you go. Piston engine. <laughs> this took way too long. <laughs> 